Today we'll go over Fresh Paint's enforced allow list feature for HIPAA accounts. This enables you to have control on what properties get sent to your downstream destinations. In an abundance of caution, if you have a HIPAA account, Fresh Paint by default will not send any properties unless they are on an allow list. There are two types of allow lists in Fresh Paint: the project allow list and destination specific allow list. You can get to your project allow list by going to a project here and clicking on the left sidebar menu here. The project allow list works globally within your Fresh Paint project. All properties listed here will be allowed listed for every single active destination. So for example, if you wanted the path name to go to every single destination for every event, you would check that here. If you have a custom property you would like to send, you can do that here as well. In order for Fresh Paint to hash the custom property prior to sending it to the destination, you'd have to check this box here. These are the built-in properties that are automatically captured by Fresh Paint for web events. And these are custom properties that you have added to your events. If you'd like to get to the destination specific allow list, you can get to there by going to the specific destination and clicking configure on the HIPAA allow list. The destination specific allow list enables you to have more fine grained control over properties sent to certain destinations. This is only available for destinations that support HIPAA mode or destinations that have a server side connection. You can add properties to a specific destinations allow list if they're known to be safe to send to that destination. Let's take the Facebook Conversions API destination, for example. The Facebook Conversions API requires a custom property called Action Source in order to accept the event. If the Action Source is website, then Facebook also requires that you include the properties URL and user agent with your events. Otherwise, the events will be rejected by Facebook. Since this is a requirement for only the Facebook destination, we will omit sensitive parts of the URL before sending it to the Facebook destination. And this will ensure that Facebook does not get any PHI. If you'd like to attribute the events or actions to a specific ad, you will also want to include the Facebook ad click ID. You can also add user properties and group properties to the allow list. For HIPAA accounts, for de by default, ID masking is enabled. Therefore, the user identifier is already hashed before sending it to the destination. If you'd like to allow list an additional user property, you can add it here. And again, if you'd like that to be hashed, you'd have to click this box here.